Hi there, my name is Stephen Gardner, and I am the best-selling author of A Bridge Over Troubled Wall Street. And I recently had an article that was published on New York Daily News about inherited IRAs and how you can maximize this money that you're given. You know, I got to tell you that receiving an IRA from somebody is, you know, next to maybe life insurance proceeds, is one of the best gifts that you can give somebody. And sometimes that money comes with some heartache, uh, maybe a lost spouse or a lost parent or a lost sibling. Uh, and, you know, n nothing, including money, will ever bring that person back. But what a beautiful gift that they left you of the money that they worked hard uh, to, to put away during their lifetime, during their career, however long or, or short that was. Um, it's a beautiful thing, but you have to you have to know that there are ways to maximize that. And one of the biggest mistakes that people make with an inherited IRA is they cash it out immediately. And, and this is it's, this is wrong because it's going to push you into a much higher tax bracket, and it's just bad advice. If you don't need the money now, the best thing you can do is stretch that IRA. Right now, sometimes I, I, I speak and, and uh, you know, people will tell me, hey, I tried Googling where to buy a stretch IRA. It's not a product. It, it's, it's, a, it's a concept. It's a strategy. And you can work with uh, me or your CPA or your advisor. Uh, but what a stretch IRA is, is basically the ability to, instead of taking a lump sum or a five-year payout, you're able to stretch that over your lifetime or over your child's lifetime until they would have been 70 and a half. Uh, and and it, it'll, it lowers the RMD, which stands for Required Minimum Distribution. Once you hit 70 and a half with a 401k or an IRA or a SEP IRA or a simple plan or a solo K, uh, at that point, the government says, hey, we gave you a long time of growing and compounding your interest without having to pay tax on that money. We're now ready to start getting paid. And there, there's no way to legally get away paying Uncle Sam. And there are, you know, some benefits to uh, paying your taxes. But there's nothing patriotic about overpaying your taxes. Okay. And so by stretching it, you're able to set up a stream of income, continue to defer that tax and grow and compound it, and maybe turn a, a small gift into a very large nest egg for you and your family uh, based on that inherited money. So definitely before you cash out an inherited IRA, make sure you understand the rules. And, and I'll make sure that the, the New York Daily News article link is by this video so that you can watch, or excuse me, that you can go in and read that. It gives more detail. But if, if, you're, if you're lucky enough to receive inherited IRA money, make sure that you go do something good with that money and make sure that you don't overpay in taxes and you don't set yourself up to be taken advantage of. Thank you for stopping by and checking out this video. My name is Stephen Gardner. I'm the best-selling author of A Bridge Over Troubled Wall Street. If you'd like to speak with me, go to yourbridgeplan.com and you can check it out or send me an email at Stephen with a PH at yourbridgeplan.com. Thank you for watching this video.